Uh, the next comedian coming to the stage, uh, new comic coming out of New York, please give it up for Chris Skull! Okay, um, <laughs> my first, uh, first time here, uh, ever, uh, shit, um, I'm from New York, <laughs> it's a city that never sleeps, and if that's true, then I guess LA's the city that never woke up, <laughs> shit, yeah, right? honestly, honestly, I wouldn't want it to, I wouldn't want it to, I'd like to keep dreaming this city too, holy shit, man. I gotta tell you what, ladies, your daddies must be thieves because they stole salt from the saline gods and put them right in your tits. <laughs> Shit, man. Oh, I was walking down the street just today and one of the ladies' titties just popped right off into my drink. Shit. I drink that tea juice. I drink it every day of the week. Unbelievable. So good, man. So good. It's good to be here in New York. New York is like so cold, man. It's like colder than a witch's tit. <laughs> Shit, man. You know why witches' titties are so cold? It's cause, cause they're witches and they're hateful. Nobody loves them. Nobody gives those titties any love in me. They're alone in the castle. You know, and no one's like, hey, uh, yeah. <laughs> you know, you, you can't do many spells. You don't get any love on your titties. You know. And their nipples are made of ice, you know? Dry ice. <laughs> Which you should never ever touch. It's a little bit of science. You stuck to those witches' titties. It's a spell I wouldn't want. I wouldn't want that on any of you. Oh shit, man. So uh so I'm new to this. Uh, I got lots of deep thoughts though, lots of deep thoughts. Um for instance, I was just thinking, oh man, do you think that horses uh, fantasize about making love to Pegasus. <laughs> you know, just like getting up on one and the Pegasus is thrusting away and it's like hovering in the in space, you know. <laughs> the love. <laughs> Shit, man. Kind of like, kind of like the same way we fantasize about making love to angels. <laughs> so, <laughs> totally. Totally similar. Oh shit, stuff I think about. Like, uh, do you think if they sent a werewolf to the moon, he'd be a werewolf permanently? <laughs> right? <laughs> oh shit, stuff I think about. It's so cold in New York, man. Which is titty cold. Which is titty cold, man. That's what you call it. WTC. Um, not World Trade Center. Which is titty cold. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Shit, man. I was like, oh, if you, have to, if you have to feel sorry for anybody, man, you gotta feel sorry for the mermaids, right? Because they got nothing going on downstairs, right? Oh. I, don't, I mean, they're definitely a mythological creature because they can't reproduce, you know, right? <laughs> it's sterile or something. So I was thinking, like, for a sailor, it's like, really? That's your fantasy? You're out to sea and you look and you hallucinate a, a mermaid on a rock? It's like, that's what you want? You want nothing down there? <laughs> You're gay, man. <laughs> so gay, man. <laughs> Shit. You're gay, man. Well, I guess sailors are gay. <laughs> Shit, man. You're loving this? You're loving this, man. Hey, uh, <laughs> I can tell. I can tell. Thinking about it, thinking about those mermaids. Um, shit. I was like, do you think snakes uh, fantasize about making love to garden hoses? <laughs> you know? Kind of like how we fantasize about making love to the skinny bitches. <laughs> shit, man. Oh, we gotta be like, oh, rail them up. Shit, man. Honestly, like, uh, I got an iPhone the other day. You guys got that, that shit? I mean, that's amazing shit. I have no idea how they make that shit go, you know, with the touching. And it's like maybe if you gave a dragon a blowjob, it would come iPhone, right? Like, how do they make it? I know I can so get it. It's amazing. It's amazing, man. I would, I would do that, too. I would do that. I would do that, man. And ladies, <laughs> ladies, if you're if you're open to it, I wouldn't mind if you'd you know brave enough and give me a little, huh? 
Oh, I'll go. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, a little bit of that. Oh, you're like, oh, I know what's wrong. Chris, you're like, Chris, go, what are you doing? Your pantomime's off, dude. Your pantomime's off. Like, oh. Is it? Is it off? Or do I have a hook dick? <laughs> Lady, what? Oh, I gotcha. Oh, I gotcha. Shit. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, God, I got some itching my ball sack a little bit. Oh, what is that? <sighs> Shit. It's my lazy eye, man. <laughs> You mean that shit? It doesn't do anything. Just sits around all day long like a lady. <laughs> oh shit, you think that's funny? Yeah, you love that? You wanna clap for that? You think it's funny? Well, guess what? I don't. <laughs> Hey, 
Hey. Uh, I just, <laughs> everyone with a beard looks like Santa. Um, <laughs> Santa! No. No! Wild again! All right. <laughs> um, <laughs> No, uh, New Orleans, I love uh, the food there. I love food. I think my next uh, gig is I'm going to try to be a food critic because I already know what my negative review is going to be when you open up the magazine. It's going to say, uh, Kristen Shaw says, I couldn't poop it out fast enough. <laughs> right? We all can relate to that, don't we? Don't we? Uh, I had that happen. Okay. Um, <laughs> this is going great. All right. So, how many people here um, are in the porn industry? Show of uh, show of giggles. Okay. So one or two. That's weird. Cause they told me that they do porn in this. And okay. Well, <laughs> whatever. Um, um, <laughs> what I wanted to share with you now is. Um, uh, for whoever's out there who was thinking about doing porn, because we're all just like shaky, um, cocaine steps away from it, right, in Hollywood. <laughs> oh, I don't like my squirt girl script. Oh, uh, <laughs> my last, that was my last idea. So, um, <laughs> um, so, uh, <laughs> okay, I'm sorry, I'm a rambling, a rambling man. Um, all I'm saying is, if you have, if you're in porn, you gotta have a good porn name. Uh, my name's Kristen Shaw, and that's just not gonna move very much merchandise past the beaded curtains. I mean, <laughs> maybe like a couple Germans will be like, ah, Kristen Shaw, but otherwise, <laughs> not so much. So um, um, there's a formula where you can take the name of your childhood pet plus the street you grew up on, and then you have uh, your, your porn name. Does anyone have a good one? Do you have one? Uh, Radar Millennium. What's that last word? Millennio. Oh, radar? Millennio. Nah, too, it's like the main for space age porn. <laughs> <laughs> okay, though, but who else? What's yours? What's yours? Uh, pepper Tall Pine. Oh, <laughs> pepper Tall Pine! I'm sorry, we got to... <laughs> That's awesome, Pepper Tall Pine. I love it so much. It's spicy, there's nature. <laughs> service ramp. <laughs> Not this. Um, but um, I, I'm figuring out a new method, a new formula that you can use where you take your favorite alcohol beverage and you combine it with um, your biggest insecurity. <laughs> so um, maybe someone might be like, you know, uh, Bloody Mary bald head, or <laughs> Maker's big vagina. That's a good one. Uh, <laughs> mine, mine would be um, Chardonnay mathematics. Chardonnay <laughs> <laughs> mathematics. Your phone is talking to you, doll. Yeah, it's just weird because it's on silent. I don't really. It's know. not though, is it? It's possessed. <laughs> you know, right? <laughs> Turn it off, maybe. What is this? <laughs> I don't care. I'm talking about porn, so you could have a ghetto box going and and boom box. <laughs> what a Michael Richards up here! All right. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm just gonna do a few more dirty things and go. Um, I wrote a I wrote a sex book, so all I can do is is take a shower after I do sets now. Um, so if I were in the porn industry, um, I don't think... <laughs> it's not funny. Okay, that would be very popular. Chardonnay Mathematics would be a hero. Um, but she, w <laughs> she wouldn't... Um, I don't think I'd let them um, put it in me, but I would uh, give incredible blowjobs. Um, I know how to give the best blowjobs. I'm gonna teach everybody tonight. Um, so how you do it <laughs> is, you, is you take your man and you you lay him down <laughs> and you give him horizontal, and then 
Um, you know, you can say hi, and then <laughs> there we go. <laughs> and then what I do is um, I just basically go around him, um, his member, um, just just like this, just like just like that. You know what I mean? Just right. I don't touch him. Not at all. Just go around. Just like that. For hours. Like this. You know? And it's like, the whole time, it's like, are you going to No. No, I'm not. I'm going to get close. <laughs> so I'm not. I'm going to touch like a snake. You know? And, and then, um, and then he'll just come from anticipation. <laughs> That's, that's a good blowjob. Okay, guys. Um, <laughs> so, uh, um, before I go, um, I, I noticed um, just from looking at everybody that uh, lots of you are not getting laid. And um, <laughs> just by look, not by your faces, but just by your body language. It's a lot of like tight, <laughs> nervous, uh, you know, closed anuses. And um, I, can, I can see that. So I just wanted to leave you guys with two um, incredible pickup lines that you can use on each other after the show when you're leaving. Uh, and yes, you're welcome. <laughs> okay. So uh, here's one you can use um, on a guy if you see a guy. Okay, is there any guy here who'd like to role? You want to role play with me real quick? I don't, this isn't real. Okay, great. <laughs> but, so, oh, look at this guy. I've been, I've been watching him, like, all night long, and, um, I, but I don't know what to say. <sighs> hey, man, oh, well, that was a pretty funny show, huh? Oh, yeah, that's great. <laughs> yeah. I just, I just, I want to ask you something. Um, are you, are you a birthday candle? <laughs> Yeah. You are? <laughs> you are? <laughs> it's amazing! Because I just thought I could maybe blow you till I got my wish. <laughs> Bam. There it is. Now, usually they say no, um, but you must be a very fancy automatronic birthday candle. <laughs> mm, I think for a wick. Okay. <laughs> and now. Okay, and finally, um, let's say that there's a, a young woman or an old woman. Um, <laughs> uh, and uh, and you, I don't know. Hi, hi. Can I use you as an example? <laughs> that was a fun show, pretty much. Except for when that guy was like a birthday candle. That was weird. Oh well. <laughs> Um, can I ask you a question? Yeah? Um, are you by chance a typesetter? No. That's too bad, because I just was hoping I could examine your colon before your next period. <laughs> wow! <laughs> that's not gross at all. Like, that. You better hope you brought a red pencil, because. Alright, guys, thank you very much. Good show, everybody! So thoroughly endearing, isn't she? Uh, last time I saw her, it was in New York, and uh, she mostly just sang single ladies, and it was awesome. 